Hello and welcome back to Gargoyle Games. This is part four of Deus Ex. If you've missed the previous parts, go back and check them out. Uh, on part three, we was uh, trying uh, to uh, get hold of uh, Richard in a room, but we couldn't get through because we didn't have a high enough clearance key card to get through by the looks of it. So once we get a high enough uh, key card, we'll go back and check out that area. So we're going to go now and look at the uh, main mission. So. We're going to uh, crack on with what mission four and see how we uh, go with that. So it just looked like at the moment with the missions, there's a lot of uh, things that we have to get to get to one part uh, and like find and like hack our way in or uh, try to find stuff. So it's um, not simple. It's just like going from mission to mission. So there is a lot of running around at the moment. So let's go on to uh, the actual train and where do we need to get to so we need to go up to here so let's travel to here so there is um a lot of like running around like I said from one area to another area trying to upgrade all your tech and, and that so you can actually uh, progress through uh, certain parts it's a shame that you can't just like go in and like have a go at the uh, the mission that you need to do but and that so it will make it interesting as well and a little bit annoying and that they have to get other parts and that's so that we'll have to go from one part of the mission to another part and eventually uh, progress it and eventually that part of the mission will be completed by the looks of it so yeah as said we're going to go and look at mission four see how we uh, get on with that and hopefully we uh, can progress through it and we'll see what happens so waiting for the uh, loading screen so we can get off this train and we can go wander around and have a look so here we go with his uh, trendy uh, upgrade matrix glasses that he has there so I have no doubt that we're gonna get uh, stopped and asked for our tickets no we don't Are we can get stopped up here no luckily we're not tend to get stopped all the time Working and getting so it's nice when we don't get stopped because that bit is purely annoying so we are back here again so let's go down Adam how's it going any trouble with the plant Patience, Alex. I'm trying to find the best way to access the motherboard without blowing my cover. Sorry, man. Message received. Yeah, as I said, like uh, on the previous uh, video, we had to look at already in this area. We uh, couldn't get through uh, another room yet again. We needed another high key car clearance. So we're going to crack on with this bit though, and hopefully, this is going to help us out. So where do we need to go? So that's where I've already gone up there. I hope this isn't the uh, same bit what I was uh, doing earlier. Yeah, so this is like the uh, NSN server room where I've already been in now and hacked. I got through here. This is where I need to get though, but this is what... What's a clearance on this uh, keypad? It's like a level uh, 2 scooter uh, rating. And I obviously haven't got that yet. There's no other way for me to get in at all. That door's locked as well. Need Jim Miller's keycard. But you know what, I'm going to have a look for, uh, so who do we need? Jim Miller. So where on earth is Jim Miller? Come on, get out of my way. Come on, move. 
Are you Jim Miller? No, you're Duncan McCready. So we do need to uh, obviously find a uh, way to get into this section without blowing my cover as well. So I wonder who is Jim McCready. We've got lots of agents. Who is this? This is Brian Rourke. Last night, the collective published the tax returns of the 50 richest people in Switzerland. Jensen, we need to talk. No, that's not consistent with the train station camera. So that's it for the top level. So let's go down to the bottom and see if we can find him. Mr. Jimmy. <coughs> no, that's an analyst. Another analyst. So this is a scooter rating three. God, it's so annoying. Anything about here useful? Can't say there is. toilet oh but we do have a shaft an air vent nope we can't even get into that air vent that's a shame we don't need to go to the infirmary That's a level three. Maybe the connection is that there is no connection. Evac team estimated ET. But all of these are analysts. Who are you? You're an analyst as well. Oh, it doesn't look like we're going to find Jim at this rate. Briefing room. Okay, everybody. What have we got? I have a report of a helicopter landing in a private airfield in Qatar. Tracking down the owner. It's a corporate shell game. I can confirm a negative and I'll take my leads. Press chopper in mind and Oh, I could do some IT support. Let's talk to the IT tech. Reach our firewall last night. Really? Oh yes, hacking software.
Let's hack his computer. See what happens. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access denied. Oh, that was bloody hard one that was. Oh, it's on a lockdown now. Well then, so I'm a bit stuck of where I need to go. Now one of the things what I could have done was the shooting range earlier. So, oh, what we've got here as well. Hey Adam. Yeah, let's talk to her again. Hey Adam, hang on a sec. Filling out supply request forms for McCready and his boys is tedious as hell, but I don't want to give him another reason to say no. Say no to what? Are you kidding me? Right now, you're the only active augmented agent we have. I'm hoping to change that. Been asking him every week, practically, but so far, permission denied. Really? He gave you a reason? Says my stress levels are too high. Told me I should sign up for meditation classes and drag Chang in with me so he'd chill out and stop changing security codes all the time. It sucks, because I really wanted to find out who those crashers in Dubai were. After the bombing, when Chang changed all the locks and codes, was he under orders? Was there a credible threat to our location? Maybe, but I don't think so. You know how he gets. Still, he wasn't the only one overreacting this time. A lot of people have been here for over 36 hours, and the state police have not exactly been cooperative. I can imagine. It took several hours before we got the security footage from the train station and the surrounding streets. It's like they don't trust Interpol. It's weird. I can almost understand Chang's paranoia. Well, Chang doesn't trust anyone, especially anyone in law enforcement. Well, if you thought he was high-strung before, the attack only made him more manic. He's making connections no one else sees, and some that may not be there. Explosions tend to damage things like sensitive electronic equipment. Right? Try telling him that. Uh, let's check out the Dubai investigation. I still can't believe Miller gave the gold mask case to McCready. Oh, I'm sorry, Adam. You were there, too. You're probably as pissed about those guys getting the drop on the team in Dubai as McCready is. Agent Singh is a big loss. But don't blame yourself. I'm sure you did all you could. It could have been worse. That's why I want to find these guys. Maybe I'll talk to McCready. See if I can help. Good luck with that. He chewed me out for asking if I could help with the case. I should have kept his new key card. I don't want him stinking up my range anyway. Stress levels, and hopefully you give me a key you card. Your stress levels were affecting your chances of becoming a field agent. Why is that? I have a rare resistance to neuropazine. I need more than the average person, especially in stressful situations. They say I'd be too expensive. So it's not just discrimination. That would be easier to deal with. It's a combination of things. Well, that combination of things is pretty bad in Prague. And getting worse. I know. But Interpol was the only agency who would give me a chance, and this is where I was assigned. I have no problem with that. I'll take whatever they throw at me. Good. It took me months of rehabilitation, getting used to the new arm, learning how to shoot again, learning how to tie my own boots. But I did it, and I'm better than I was before. I want to help, and I can. My place is out there in the field where I can make a difference. You know that. And if you can do it, so can I. Don't give up, Aria. Semper Fi. Hoorah. Looks like we have to leave then. Well, I better let you get back to work. Yeah, sure. Talk to you later. Well, you didn't exactly give me much stuff, did you? So, what do we have here? More crafting part. Mine template. Okay. Well, that's a good uh, gun storage. There's no bloody guns in there. God, this is a rating four, so we can't get into that one. Um, what's the betting? Yeah, rating five. Can't wait until we can get into stuff. All right, let's look at the shooting range. And doesn't look like we can do. Uh, Much stuff of wise. Never know, we might bump into somebody what we need to. Mm. 
I think anything can lock us. Nothing really by the looks of it. What's that there? We need all these crafting parts. Oh, so we can maybe do something now. View and hold. Crafting parts. Click crafting parts to craft items or customize your weapons. Yep. On the internet, access crafting menu using RB, blah, blah, blah. So let's have a look what's in. Nothing in there. So the um, crafting parts and it's here. So we've got 60 parts available at the moment. So we can't really do much. So we are going up, but we need some other bits and the, all the uh, augmentations are still uh, disabled. So we can't use cloaking or anything at the moment. What pretty much sucks. So enter the shooting range, go on and let's have a little look at the shooting range. So you've decided you need some practice, huh? What sort of guns have we got? Pick up the ten mil pistol, eh? Try to get spot on targets. You know the best tip my training officer ever gave me? Reload your weapon before it's empty. Saves time. If you zoom in using iron sight, you'll acquire targets faster. Try it. You'll see the difference. That's that good one. Alright then, let's get onto the combat rifle. So uh, to equip my combat rifle, I need to hold the uh, right and then press A. Nope. Let's just get it out like that. So then. Where do we actually uh, take this down then? So where do you actually take them down? Is it the light? Ah, uh, you just need to shoot them a lot then. So a lot of ammo. That is a lot of rounds. Aha. Uh -huh. So you hold X, so we've got ammo type, firing pattern, full auto. Got that, so we go with that then. Come on. Thank you. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that was bad. They go down a lot quicker. Pick up some more rounds then. I think I'm nice and full. Targets. Once you've disabled a security device, your armor piercing rounds will take it out more easily. You should always have at least one backup weapon so you can improvise, adapt. Overcome any situation. Hoorah. Hoorah. Seems like you're warmed up now. Let's go over some of the other aspects of your weapons. So we need a combat rifle then. I guess I've just combined the silencer. I like how silencers reduce sound, but the trade off is less stopping power, less damage per hit. Headshot. Sounds a lot louder without silence, huh? I prefer to get a key card. Cool, so we've got um, a lot of weapons then. Take all the ammo. But probably not going to help me because you're going to take away the gun now, aren't you?
Okay. So I'm still actually stuck to where I actually go. So it's telling me to plant the uh, whisperer chip. Alex Vega, his contact gave me a listening device to plant inside the uh, TF-29's holographic conference system. To do it, you'll have to find a way into the inner servers. So I can't get into the servers though at all though, can I? Been in there, that doesn't help me. Viewed that bit. There's nothing else where I can get to, is there? Ah, oh god. I missed that one. So hopefully now, this is going to get me to where I want to go. So, oh no, all that is, is for that bit there. It's got to be another uh, way to go. That's where I've just came in. How annoying. Oh, we can get up there though, and there's something up there. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, yes. Come on, how do I get through here now? I need to get down there. I need to move these boxes somehow. So what can we do? Oh, there's a hatch here. There you go. I missed that bit. Gotcha. So now it looks like we can actually, uh, oh what's this, hacking south software. Well we always need the hacking stuff because we need to uh, definitely upgrade our stuff. Still can't stand up here. So now it looks like we can get down here, so that's pretty cool. And now we can open this door. Yes, baby. So we've uh, done the bit what we needed to do. God, you definitely have to keep your eyes open on this game. There's so much like hidden stuff where you don't actually see where you think you can't go, but you can go eventually. Yes, now we can use our whisperer chip. Alex, the whisperer chip is in. Jesus, Adam, is Miller in there right now? Shit, gotta go. Jensen, I need to see you now. Well, probably need to get out of here then. Anything else here that we can take there? Doesn't look like it. Let's get out of here. Well, I'm glad I've done that bit because I was stuck on that. Where is he? Oh, he's in this part. Agent Jensen reporting for duty, sir. Tried to do it earlier, but you were on a conference call. Yeah, I was. Should I be worried about you, Jensen? 
Sorry. That blow you took to your systems. It's not messing with your head or anything, making you do things. I'm not gonna go crazy and start attacking people, if that's what you're worried about. You've been checked out then. The problem with your orbs is gone. Not yet. Thought I should check in with you first, see if there was something I can do here. I appreciate the spirit, but your top priority when we're done here is getting your system up and running. God knows, with all what's happened, I need you at 100% right now. You sounded pissed when you called me in. Everything okay? Don't ever leave the field, Jensen. You'll regret it. As soon as you strap a desk to your ass, you'll be swimming in goddamn politics. The boss is giving you trouble. What? Ah, oh, that. No, the trouble state police. They're pushing us out of the Razika investigation. I want you over there to make sure that doesn't happen. You're putting me on the train station attack? Not Dubai? Forget Dubai. McCready's handling it. How do we accept or insist? I'm gonna insist. With all due respect, we were blindsided in Dubai. And those mercs put up one hell of a firefight. I'd like to know who they were. They were augmented, Jensen. Chances are this will lead right back home. To the train station attack? Maybe. It's possible. But we won't know for sure if we don't investigate both. Max a solid agent. I'm confident he'll dig up something on the gold mask. In the meantime, I want you looking into Razika before the state police fuck up our crime scene. Yes, sir. You said they're trying to push us out? I sent Fletcher in this morning to oversee evidence collection. Seems he's being detained because he hasn't checked in since. They can't lock us out. The Czech Republic signed our UN mandate agreement. They gave us jurisdiction over terrorist investigations. Yeah, well, the former director of their security information services runs state police now. He's come up with a loophole, claiming this attack falls under the homegrown terror exemption. Homegrown? He's saying it's ARC? The Augmented Rights Coalition? I don't care what he's saying. He may even be right. I just want us in there so we can find out. So where do I start? Technically, you're supposed to speak to our psychologist before getting back into action. I don't need a shrink. Maybe not. But you do need to get your system sorted. So go take care of that. And let me know when it's done. And then? How do I get to Ruzika? The metro stop's been closed. I'll work on getting you a ride. Just don't take too long, Jensen. We need to get ahead of this. Copy that. Cool. So at least we've uh, progressed now and done some more to the uh, mission. I hate wandering around and not actually knowing where to go. And uh, so it's nice when we figure it out. And yeah, it's definitely we figure it out. So you can see where I go as well. So mission three now is my objective out there. So let's look at my missions now. Yeah, so my missions is just that now, getting uh, into uh, shape again. So we've got nothing else to actually do. We've got uh, the side missions still. Also, it actually changes now. Cult to personality, travel. Yeah, so it, once you actually do something, then it takes something away, but, uh, obviously. So it is definitely uh, different every single time by the looks of it. I might be wrong. So my missions, what was, what I did have, have now gone. So I've only got one objective. So let's get on with it then. See if I can clean it up. So it looks like I've got to go back up in the uh, lift. Yeah. Chip. We got something, but Janus provided the wrong algorithm for the frequencies, so they aren't getting deciphered correctly. Can you fix it? I'm a pilot, not a programmer. I can do it, but it's going to take some time. Well, by the looks of it, you've got all the time in the world, because it looks like this game is going to be one hell of a long game. What's wrong with him? 
So now where do we go? So it looks like we've got to go to the uh, metro again, the train station. Yep. Oh, killer. <laughs> So hopefully uh, we uh, can complete the uh, next part of this mission. That would be pretty cool if we can. So it does look like that you don't always need a key, uh, a key card to get into an area. There is maybe sometimes you can uh, sneak your way in like we just uh, did on that part. Uh, so hopefully we can uh, find other areas if we do have to sneak in. But I want to get into some gunfights. We've had no gunfights at all yet. It is all about, like, at the moment, like, finding information out what... I suppose it's pretty cool as well, but definitely I like a bit of gunfighting. Stay away from us or I'll so we're out of the metro now. So are we back to where we first started? Is this going to take me to the person outside that room, isn't it? Uh, yep. So we're still trespassing, so right, yeah. let's look at the map, let's see where we can go on this. So we're here at the moment, so we checked out the sewers, and the sewers didn't get us anywhere. So we've got a ladder here, and what else have we got? We might be able to get into the back of the uh, stuff, so let's have a look, see if we can go down here. So can we go down here? Doc Larry, Doc Larry, show me latest papers. Otherwise, you cannot go through. I know the drill. The drill has changed. Too many forgeries. All Ogs must now carry a supplementary permit authentication card. Do you have this card? God, so I don't even have that now. So go on, let's bluff it. Must have left it in my other coat. You expect me to believe that? I expect you to believe that my docs are up to date. I wish it was that simple. Unfortunately, brand new measures just got implemented. If you try to continue this way without latest permit, I am legally obliged to shoot you. Is that right? My friend, I know what you're thinking. It's terrible the way they make laws against your kind. But listen, maybe I can do something to help. We could come to an understanding. What kind of understanding? Lucky for you, I know a guy. An expert in... Permitification. A document agent. He offers permits, authentication cards peace of mind. With his help, you go wherever you want, whenever you want. No more hassles. What do you say? Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. This document agent you mentioned, you see the one in charge? He gets you to stop Oggs and offer them this opportunity to do business with him. Go see for yourself. My friend has documents to pass checkpoints to keep police off your back. To get into parts of Prague you never knew existed. 
Tell him Drahumir sent you. You'll see. I give you address, yes? Yes, please. Uh, give me the address. I think I'd like to see who's behind all this. Chekashka. There is a courtyard behind the apartment building. Very easy to find. My friend will be there. He will get you latest permit card. Just pay him and don't ask questions. Cool. So now we need to uh, meet the document agent. So we'll go do that. I and mean, then hopefully this will get us into this section and we can go um, and sort it out for where I need to go. to So we can uh, meet this like first like mission. Well, not the first, it's a third mission. So here we go. Let's hope we've got what he wants as well. You looking for permit? Yeah. Oh, I am. This area is restricted to you, Orb. You're uh, not on the guest list. Is he the permit? You looking for permit? Yes. I was stopped by someone named Drahomir at a checkpoint. He sent me here. Apparently you help Augs with documentation, upgrade their permits. You have the money. Maybe. You want to tell me what I'm paying for exactly? You pay to get your name on the list. Melina upstairs, she works on your shiny new permit. You come back in one week to pick it up. Standard pickup fee will apply. How much do you charge people for this? Not people. Augs. 35,000 credits. How much? Phew. We can confront, bluff, or pay it. Well, I don't even know if I've even got that sort of money. I don't think I have. Let's. Well, he said just to pay it, but you can't pay it yet, so. So let's confront him. You're not even trying, are you? You just blatantly scam Augs out of as much as you can. You want updated permit or not? Documents are actually pretty good. You'll see. Trust me. The girl is very talented. These documents, what are they? Stolen? Forged? Invisible? Look, just give me what you have, and I'll put your name on the list. That's how it works. Melina does surprisingly good work. Puts more effort in than we ask her. <laughs> Let's insult pay 35. Sneak around. This is as much as I'm willing to give you. So what kind of shiny new permit does this get me? Fucking tourist. You're wasting my time, Og. So let's confront the forger upstairs then. Fucking drug. Over there. Oh. You hear that? Oh no! There's so many restricted areas now. I haven't even got a gun, how am I supposed to attack you? Even he's shooting at me. So then, we uh, definitely need to uh, sneak around by the looks of it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we can't go into uh, that part. Otherwise, we get our head blown off like we just did. So, I wonder how we're going to sneak around. If you know, pull it in the comments down below. Don't watch all the video and pull it in. Just go to the comment section right now and put in how you think we're going to get in. And let's see if you're right at the end of the video. But uh, time will tell once we get past this loading screen and we're in. So let's talk to him one Come more time. Later. We're waiting for new week. 
Oh, so he wants me to come back then. So, right then. So, I'm there and that's there. Oh, God, mate, it's right next to my apartment. <laughs> I bet you I could sneak through from my apartment, maybe. Probably can't, though. So, there's an alley there. So, let's look in the alley. Yeah. Hopefully, this will be the way that we can sneak in. You never know. So, we ain't going to get down there. And that's where we definitely need to get through. Oh, what's this? Movable large propane can Grab too heavy. Right. Let's go. This is net. Ah, oh. I thought that would be an event to get through at least. It's a way too heavy to move. Oh, oh I can throw it. Let's hope that if I throw it, at this. Come on. Nope, so we can't break the uh, vent. That ain't going to do a lot either. So we need to get into that door. We need to turn off the uh, circuit brake like electric thing there so we can get through. How on earth do we do that? Is there any more barrels or anything? Hmm. Can't do anything here. Oh, oh. So what's that up there? Come on, up you go. Nope. Anything up top? <laughs> this game certainly makes you uh, makes you think it really does. I bet you I can't jump onto that. Oh, I can. Oh, the door's locked. I wonder if I could jump again over to there. Hey! That was pretty good. I didn't think that would actually uh, let me do that. So, pretty cool. Now I can we actually get into the door. Locked. So this is a scooter right in four, so we can't get through. But we need to get through there. Oh, there is a, a hatch or something there. So we need to figure out how to get into this area. There's no events or anything there, is there? No. Let's go back to this part now. Nothing there. How annoying. So, I'm either missing something from what I'm supposed to be doing. Or, I do need a genuine a key card to get in. Anything up the top here? Nope. Can I get up there? Nope. So it doesn't look like I'm getting in this way. So we definitely can't get through that way there. Oh, so let's go. Can we go up here? Yep. Aha. Uh -huh. Now. And hey, let's go for the window then. 
Hopefully this will take us into uh, the area where we want to go. Let's pick up all these beers and everything. Might come useful. Don't really want to move the fridge. Anything in the bathroom? Nope. So this place is pretty small. Oh, there's a door here, it's low. Hopefully we can get through this door now. Is it getting rid of them? Yeah. Oh, I can't get through the door there. So it doesn't look like there's anything else we can actually uh, do in this uh, apartment. Is there an air vent or anything in there? N nope. But we might be able now to get through to the other side. Oh hey, ah. So we're now on the ledge we can get to there. Oi. So we're going to sneak in. Yeah, I like it. So, that's... Oh, no. So I'm in a restricted area. Can we, we can't get in this window here, can we? Nope. We should. Oh, can we walk across here? That would be cool if we could. Yep. You're dead. Let's go. Hmm. Now, I don't know if we can hang on ledges or anything. So, there's a break system box there. The bombing was bad for business. He's now gone, so we can sneak in maybe. Yay! Oh wow, we can walk on the roof and everything, so... We're getting to where we need to go. So that's where we need to go into that door there. So, we'll wait for him to go. And then we'll sneak back in. Or do we go in through a window? That all looks shut up. It doesn't look like we're going to get through anywhere else. So yeah, we'll drop down. And we'll see how it goes. Has he gone in? Oh. Has he seen me? Oh no. I've been bloody caught. Let's just jump down and see if we can take him out. Yeah, first bit of action. Oh, let's get into the air vent, is it? Ah, so that's where I just was. No one asked about. Now check over here. Oh god. Can I kill the two people? You're dead. Oh there, guns blazing, it might have to be then. Oh, but we'll take the uh infantry full. So we do have some guns as well. We don't need all this stuff, do we? 
so... Oh, <laughs> I've just realised I've just drunk the beer and now I am completely dazed. That's quite funny. So we're getting there, we are. I think I need something to uh, soap me up probably now. Pills now. Old man, what's this? Painkillers. So let's go through drunk, then that'll be fun. Right, so it looks like we've got an electric uh, like fence here, so cameras and that as well. So how are we going to get through this part? Hmm, oh yes. A hatch. Yep. Can we go down it? Yeah. Nice. Oh god, this bit's gonna be iffy then. So I don't know if this is actually gonna make me die, because normally the smoke does. Maybe if we run really quickly. Where are we? Where are we? Nope. Am I gonna die? Yeah. I've just committed myself to death. So we need to figure a way to get through this section now. So we can get this um, like pass so we can get through the other areas. So we need to figure out how we can do this. So we're actually into what the uh, outside of the uh, compound complex sort of thing. So we need to get inside to see this woman. And then we can get our passes and we can get on our way. And then we can get back to where that policeman was and we can get through that area. So where's it going to start me up from? Oh, that's pretty cool. So this starting from here. So, I don't know. I don't think there's really much down this hatch what we can actually do, to be honest. I'll double check it. But I don't really think there actually is anything we can do. Nah, we don't want to go down there and there's not much what I can actually see down there. So we're going to go back up and actually see if we can find another way to go. Everyone's dead outside, so... Let's go up on the roof. These are locked, we can't get into them from here. Can't do anything there. So that's the event where we went through there. What brought us out that side? Hmm. 
Hmm, I wonder if we can actually get in through that window there, maybe. Let's have a little look. Don't think we can get up that high. Uh, if we can get up a bit higher, we might be able to get on the opposite side of the roof. Nah, doesn't look like we can do it one more time. Nah. All these windows are shut off as well, aren't they? We've already been through that part there. I've got to be missing something, I really have. Yeah. There's a camera out there. So how... So we might need to throw this camera maybe. Uh, this box at the camera. Nope. So we need to move the uh, camera so we can go through that part to get through that obviously. Now. Might be able to just run through it quickly. Oh. So we're going to get people coming down, yeah. Have to take him out. Looks like there's another camera up here. So I thought there would be something that like I wouldn't be able to walk through them, uh, like, like electric fence bits, but looks like we can do it. Well, now this bit looks a lot more harder. No. Right. There's got to be some way to get through this. Aha, uh -huh. so we go down this way. Attack that. And there's a camera, so we'll go through this way. And here's the security bit. Right, let's see if we can hack this then. So, we've got that to that to there, to there. Oh, this is different to what I've normally seen. Guide. Do, 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 do. So, capture, yeah. Get that. Diagnostic, security rating, capture level one. So do we just have to do all of these? Okay, let's have a little go then. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access denied. Oh, I didn't see the green one there. So we've now got to wait for the lockdown. It looks like it's cooling down pretty quickly. So halfway done now and we can get in and we can get this section done. Definitely want to get this section done. And then we, uh, oh, there's a doorway there, but definitely need to get into this computer. Right, back in again then. So I didn't see that bit there, like a dirt. So... Oh. Yes, go to that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We need to get this done. Oh, no way. So we've got to go from, from that bit to that bit to that bit. I can see how it works. 
So these uh, hackings are getting harder. So I can definitely see how it works now though. By the looks of it. Hopefully this time we do it. Third time lucky. Let's see while that's cooling down. What this door is actually saying. Oh no there's the actual. Uh, the, uh, is it the uh, camera? Yeah. So we don't want to be going through uh, there just as yet. This will take down. Or we'll take that crafting bit. So let's see if we can do it this time. Access granted. Thank you. Third time was lucky. So we've now got the cameras, doors, and everything. So it looks like, oh yeah, we can open. Yeah, there's a door. That's pretty cool now. Cameras. Disabled. Disabled. And the mist device, whatever this is. Flag laser. Wall. Turn that off. So things done, yeah. Hold on. Vault doors opened. And the camera's all turned off. Cool. Yeah, hey. So now, yeah, we're back up to where this bit was. So now we need to find these papers, I presume. There she is. Tell me what's going on here. Arts and crafts? I think you work for those scam artists out there. Or do they work for you? <laughs> it was never meant to be a scam. More like uh, social services for the disaffected. <laughs> you know, like no og left behind. Looks like a forgery ring to me. I hate the word forgery. I prefer graphic arts activism. I, I help people to, to be other people. And seriously, try getting anywhere with forgery on your resume. You're involved in something that takes advantage of people, and you're worried about your resume? If that, that may have come out wrong. I mean, yes, career is important, but it's not everything. I know that. I, t I tend to get really nervous when I'm stressed. I, I mean, I, I'm stressed when... Which always just makes things worse. Oh, okay, look. I have no reason to be nervous here, do I? You're totally on my side, right? One of the good guys, not like Dravomir. Let's reassure uh, we want some papers. I just need you to explain it to me. The essentials of what's been going on here. Essentials, right. Essentially, I was trying to help my augmented friends. The way I saw it out there, the promise of fake documents was being used to extort people. How does that help them? The extortion part sucks. I swear to you, I'm totally anti-extortion. Obviously. Let me explain. It's the government. They print up these official permits each month. But they only sell them to the rich corporate and military allies. Meanwhile, the other orgs, they get kettled out of the city because their documents aren't up to date enough. That's what was happening to my friends. Whatever your intentions here, you're part of a criminal operation. So that's what the shady types were all about? Gee, thanks for pointing that out. The gun in my face wasn't a clear enough indication. The city cracking down on forgeries and my friends all getting deported anyway. That was all part of my master plan here. When things got out of hand, obviously I wanted to stop. Why didn't you? I was scared. Drahumir said he would kill me. Looked at me kind of... Like you're looking at me now. You're not going to kill me, are you? What do you think? I'm not sure yet. Look, the real problem is Drahumir and that checkpoint of his. Without him in the picture, the rest of them couldn't run a lemonade stand. 
Maybe you could. You know. You think I just walk around shooting people? Don't you? I like knowing there are other options. Okay, so stab him, scare him, or get the police to do their job for once. I remember Drahomir mentioning this cop who threatened him. She was hanging around his checkpoint. Who knows? Maybe there really is one good cop in Prague. That sounds like the safest bet. Otherwise, you're asking me to pick a fight with a bunch of guys in uniforms, scam artists or not. The whole city would come down on you. Still, up to you how you want to handle it. Right. And just so we're clear, you are going to stop forging documents now. I don't like getting into trouble. And even worse is other people suffering because of me. No more faking documents ever again. Unless someone really, really needed one. Then I'd probably do it. I mean, if we knew for a fact that we could help someone, we should do whatever we can, right? Yeah, well, I need one. It depends what you have in mind. The docs I make, they really can fool the authorities. Sort of. Sort of. Drachmir flooded the streets with forgeries, so the city started attacking more, adding scanners, validation numbers. Now, unless one of my projects gets activated in the city database, it just blasts me. So you're telling me these people pay for forgeries and then probably get deported anyway? It doesn't have to be that way. I have two permits that I literally just made. And I think we can really help these people. If you're willing. Yeah, I want to help. All right, how do we help? Their names are Edward Broad and Irenka Bauer. Drahomir was going to charge them like 20 more times. But maybe you could just give them the forgeries? Early Christmas present? You said it's just plastic that people get deported anyway. How does this help them? I think I know how to get them activated. As long as you're willing to follow through. All right. I'll go meet Edward and Irenka. In the meantime, are you going to be okay here? Once they learn that Drahomir's been taken care of, the others will leave me alone. He's the one I'm scared of. I've already taken care of the guys outside. They won't be a problem. Thank you. As mysterious military types go, you're pretty neat, I guess. By the way, there is a safe over there where they keep their money. I'll give you the code 2489. Feel free to help yourself. What about you? Way ahead of you. So where's the safe? Then there's a safe over there, where? Right, let's go for the vent. Come on, I want to go in there. That's locked. Unlock.
Open sesame. So we've got what some frag grenades that come in useful. I want to open it. And we've got some uh, chips as well. So that's pretty much everything that we've got. And let's get out this way. And we're out. So are we back to where we was in this part here? Hey, so that's it for uh, this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, give it a big thumbs up. And I'll catch you on the next video, what will be part five. So I'll be saying go, go out. And please uh, come along and join me on the rest of my uh, journey.